Hello, Sagittarius. Sag. Hey, Sag. Hey, hey, Sag. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Hope you guys had a good weekend. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Um, you know, Pretty is here to get you guys through another week to see, you know, which kind of lunatic, what kind of maniac is going to show their face. Um, what kind of demon you guys are dealing with now. So keep in mind the situation could be reverse, vice versa, interchangeable. If you are cross-watching, you're watching this for an equip, um, Aquarius. Some of you don't want Aquarius. If you're watching this for a Sagittarius, then, you know, the Sagittarius may have done X, Y, and Z. So just keep that in mind. All right, here we go for Sagittarius, please. Some of you sick and tired because the exhausted card just came out. <laughs> Y'all sick and tired with the sick and tired. Around 11 or 12 minutes, I'm going to be using these uh, messages, okay? It's a lot of <laughs> juicy messages in there, so stay tuned for the tea. What is coming towards Sagittarius and love spirit? Tap me into the higher selves of Sagittarius. Receptive. Open heart, softness, and vulnerability. What is coming towards Sagittarius and love? Trapped, stuck, tied down, and captive. What's coming towards Sagittarius in love? Unconditional innocence, support, whole heart. What's coming towards Sagittarius in love? Confessions, unexpected message, unveiling, justification. Very interesting. Bottom of the deck is concealing. Don't that motherfucker look creepy? What is that? A cat or a car? Oh, that's a cat. Secrets, mysteries, and hiding. Okay. Woo, some motherfucker tricky. It's tricky. Tricky, 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 tricky. <laughs> what is coming towards Sagittarius in love, please? Actually, let me shuffle this way. What is coming towards Sagittarius in love, please? What do you have? Okay, worth waiting for. What do you have for Sagittarius in love? Okay. All right, interesting. So we have heart-to-heart -heart conversations worth waiting for and stay optimistic about your love life. Interesting. Sag so like, yeah, right. I ain't waiting on shit. <laughs> I could just I could just hear you guys saying that now. Like <laughs> Woo! Sagittarius in love. Angels, what is coming towards Sagittarius and love? Sagittarius and love. Sagittarius. What is coming towards Sagittarius and love? Some of you dealing with a water sign. What is coming towards Sagittarius and love? So you're definitely connected to a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpio. Wow. Sag, what the freak? <laughs> you got the Ten of Cups, the Ace of Cups in reverse, though. The Page of Wands in reverse. The moon in the reverse. Interesting. I feel like there's a lot being um, suppressed here. Somebody's probably really suppressing their true feelings for you. They're not really expressing anything. I feel like um, someone in the situation really sees you as their ten of cups. Sagittarius, whoever the hell this person is, they really do see this. You know, you see the motherfuckers is real happy. They got all the cups. You know, he holding her and all that other sh other shit. But there's something that is down below the surface that maybe someone's trying to hide from you. Could be their feelings. Tell me more. What is coming towards Sagittarius in love? Tell me more about the situation with Sagittarius in love. Tell me more. Wow, the Knight of Cups. This is a good reading for Sagittarius. What the freak? I haven't seen like a, a real like heartfelt reading for Sag in a minute, man. I'm happy for you guys. Tell me more. Let's, let's, let's hope it's not short-lived. What is coming towards Sagittarius in love? What is coming towards Sagittarius in love? One more spirit. I feel like Sagittarius... Wow, the Six of Cups in the reverse. Lovers in reverse. Some of you, you're, you know, you guys are separated. It's going to be a Gemini. Five of Cups. But there's definitely some sadness here. Somebody could possibly still be holding on to their past or reliving the past. Whether that be with you or, you know, someone else. And maybe this is why they haven't told you how they feel or they haven't expressed anything to you. But bottom line, I'm just seeing someone who 
they it's like they have a lot of feelings for you ace of cups reverse knight of cups the moon reverse but they're not telling you why and i think that's why heart to heart conversations is here and trapped their emotions are trapped receptive maybe they need to open their heart but they want to confess this to you they want to let you know how they're feeling whoa all right pisces as soon as i cut the deck i'm getting like strong water here though strong water Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpio. All right, angels, tell me about this Ten of Cups coming towards Sagittarius and love. Ten of Cups. The Seven of Pentacles. Somebody here could have some trust issues, possibly, or maybe you just don't know if you could trust this person. Okay, especially if this is a new person in your life. Somebody's like, oh, can I trust this, per this person, you know? Should I move on and, you know, open my heart and make myself vulnerable? Tell me more about the Ten of Cups. I feel like someone's sighing, like, oh, you know, this could be so great between Sagittarius and I. Like, you know, we could really be happy together and all that. But at the same time, there's still some kind of um, resistance or overthinking. Some of you feel like this person's your twin flame. But someone's definitely in their head about you, Sagittarius. Motherfucker's up late at night. <laughs> Someone's really um, picturing a future with you. Tell me about the Ace of Cups reverse for Sagittarius in love. Ace of Cups reverse. <laughs> Ace of Cups reverse. But there's some suppressed feelings. Nine of Pentacles. Yep, motherfucker overthinking. I feel like Sagittarius, for some of you, um, you could be friends with benefits or just casual with this person. You guys are just casually seeing each other. Or this person may want something casual. They may not feel like they're ready for a relationship. Or although they have these strong feelings for you, this strong desire for you. I see that they're still kind of holding back their feelings or deciding to keep their feelings to themselves. Why? Because maybe they just kind of still want to be single. Maybe they enjoy their single life. Somebody's kind of like, well, there's an opportunity here. I mean, because look at this. You're like, oh, should I, should I not? Mm, I don't know. Do I want to invest? Do I want to, you know, set myself up to possibly get hurt again? Someone just kind of doesn't know if they should trust it. They may feel like it's too good to be true. Um, this could also be you. You may feel like it's too good to be true with whoever the hell this person is. So that could be why, you know, although you have like a lot of chemistry with them, you know, you're really comfortable with this person. Feel like you feel like you could tell this person anything. Tell me about the page of wands in the reverse, please. Page of wands reverse for Sagittarius in love. Page of wands reverse. The world. Ten of swords reverse. The knight of wands reverse. So this person could be fearing commitment. Somebody could be fearing commitment. Or they're just afraid. That's what I'm seeing here. Maybe they're afraid of getting hurt, being hurt. You got the three of swords and the, um, the moon here. All right, angels, what is buried below the damn surface? What is the moon about in the reverse for Sagittarius? And love, the moon reverse. The moon reverse, child. Hierophant, wow. So deep down, somebody may fear commitment. Deep down, somebody may be fearing this. Um, could be a Taurus. I feel like with this moon next to temperance, I feel like someone may struggle with some kind of depression or uh, someone could even be bipolar here. Uh, but it's almost like someone's kind of, they have just like a lot of fear, like a, something like that. Yeah, someone's heart chakra is blocked. Tell me about the Knight of Cups for Sagittarius in love. Knight of Cups for Sagittarius in love. Knight of Cups. Ooh, okay, well, the motherfucker might just be opening up and expressing their feelings to you, Sagittarius. Or at least they're thinking about it. Could be a Virgo. But this, I feel like this person, sometimes they tend to drink a lot. And when they drink a lot, they get emotional and then they want to reach out to you. <laughs> or something like that. This is someone who, who I don't know. Or they try to drown out their feelings by drinking or something like that. But... They really want to express like their feelings to you, Sagittarius. They're really thinking about it deeply right now, about opening up to you. 
tell me about the six of cups in the reverse sometimes the nine of cups doesn't really indicate the person will open up to you though that's the thing you know nine of cups could be someone who's a little flaky or they're dreaming about it or whatever but <sighs> tell me about the six of cups in the reverse for sagittarius in love six of cups reverse for sagittarius in love but if you think that this person has forgotten about you sagittarius they really haven't they haven't their feelings for you are actually very strong you see knight of cups reverse but they're not expressing it they want to make a change and do it, it could be a leo it's like this person's really afraid of getting hurt again or wow so that's why spirit may be saying that it's worth waiting for because i do feel like they have the right intentions for you sagittarius i don't see that this is a player or someone who they may just want to be single right now, have something casual with you. That doesn't make them a player because the real problem is that they're afraid to really get hurt. They may have trust issues. Um, so what else is being hidden from Sagittarius in this love situation? What else is being hidden from Sagittarius in this love situation? The Knight of Pentacles, yeah, in the reverse. Some of them, they don't feel like they're ready to settle down to be in a relationship the knight of pentacles in reverse is also a card of distrust they don't have trust maybe they just don't trust you or they just don't trust people in general yeah that's what i'm really feeling i think i have some ego and pride as well they have a problem with really um maybe they feel like emotions or something like that makes them weak or something all right well advice for sagittarius in this love situation advice oh shit it's time for me to pull the cards Okay, so the advice here, if, the, if you're the Sagittarius who's afraid to open your heart to this person, Spirit could be saying you need to go after what the hell you want, okay? For those of you, I feel like right now this person's kind of still juggling the thought of being in a relationship. Um, and right now, it's likely that they may kind of come in and out your life or something like that because they're just not sure. They're just not sure. That's what I feel. But it may be worth waiting for. Because like I said, I don't feel like they don't have feelings for you. They actually really do. But it's going to take some time to maybe for them to express that or to even open up about that. Hmm. Angels, tell me about this situation for um, Sagittarius in love. Tell me about this situation for Sagittarius in love. Tell me about this situation. Gemini. <laughs> it could be a Gemini. Okay. Wow, I love you is at the bottom of the deck. I love you. That's just for, for Sagittarius from this person. What does Sagittarius need to know about this love situation, Spirit? Messages, please, for Sagittarius about this love situation. Messages for Sagittarius about this love situation. Messages for Sagittarius about this love situation. They may have low self-esteem. They may have low self-esteem. Okay. I'm seeing that this person is trying to resist you or something like that. <laughs> oh, child, Sag. Mm. I feel y'all pain with this person. I feel your pain. I reread our text messages, ready to open my heart. You see what I'm saying? Ready to open my heart. Anything else for Sagittarius in this love situation? Anything else that Sagittarius should be aware of in this love situation? Well, Sag, this person is definitely trying to resist you. They're trying to resist you. Messages for Sagittarius in this love situation. Oh my God, that shit came out twice, Sag. What the freak? Okay. Low self esteem came out twice. And they want to let you know that it's not just about sex. So you may feel like they're just trying to play you or whatever the case may be, but. 
they want to let you know it's not just about sex. So you may be friends with benefits with this person thinking that, okay, that's all this person wants me for, but that's not what it is. It'll be a cancer. Cancer's at the bottom of the deck. Trying to resist you once again came out. Aries. Wow. So that's what I have for you, um, Sagittarius. Let me know what the freak is going on here. It's just like this person is hiding a lot from you. And I think it has to do with their feelings. So love you all very much. Let me know what's going on. See you guys next time.